Welcome to Nukohiva and the town of Tahawahi. Before I get started with my video, here's an overview of Nukohiva. It's located about 2,200 miles south southeast of Hawaii and about 3,200 miles south southwest of the continental United States. As we zoom in here, you can see this is part of the Marquesas Islands. And just shows the basic shape of Nukuhiva and the town where we'll be anchored in the center. The tender boats arrive here at the tender pier. On our first visit, we walked off to our left about a mile along the harbor to a museum and a restaurant located at the end. On our second visit, we went up to the top of this rise where we saw the largest statue in the Pacific. And that'll be the focus of the video today. Also, there is a Notre Dame Cathedral that you could stop by on your way to the museum. There's one tour available on Nukahiva. You can either book it through HAL or separately. It consists of riding along in a caravan of jeeps, stopping at various points along this route. And now, on to the video. This is the harbor at Tahawahi Nukahiva. The tender boats moor below this overlook. The harbor is crescent shaped and goes on for about a mile, ending at a museum and a restaurant. Closer are a few cafes and bars and also a series of shops. And here is the harbor on the other side of the town. Here we go. We are arriving in uh, Nukahiva. Nukahiva, the tender pier. There is a welcoming band and people. Those are the new restrooms for Nukahiva. So we're walking up to the statue overlooking the harbor. It's not too far, a little bit uphill. As you leave the port off to your right is the town where you find the hospital, post office, police station, and city hall. But this path takes you up to the statue. On the road to the main statue, there's some smaller statues. We're here at Fort Coulette, which is the site of the largest sculpture in the Pacific, Tiki Tuhiva, which is a sculpture of a warrior Tuhiva and a woman Tiki. The woman Tiki is 40 feet tall. The male Tiki Tuhiva is 26 feet tall. And it symbolizes the woman giving birth to the strength of the warrior Tiki Tuhiva. It's a beautiful spot and it overlooks the harbor where the ship is anchored. We're walking down from Port Gillette towards the main harbor area. There's a communal market here. A lot of fresh produce, vegetables, bags of other fruit, coconuts, the price list.
great port visit at Nukahiva. There's a bar, a snack bar, right by the tender landing. Sells beers, $7, has some Wi-Fi. Fast enough. A few shops here. One selling t-shirts and women's clothes. This one here is Yacht Services, which sells things that are more suited for people on sailboats. And there's quite a few here anchored that uh, may stay here for a while because this is one of the first stops for yacht owners on their Trans-Pacific journeys. So a nice port. Uh, there's some tours to the inland, but it's a pleasant place to catch a few beers, maybe get some local food, and just walk around in some pretty pleasant weather.